Hey y'all, so it's day three. I'm gonna talk about day two, I'm gonna talk about day three. So day two was, I'll say the hardest day for me. I was having really bad headaches. Um, it wasn't too much the hunger getting to me, it was the headaches. So I decided to make me some soup. Got cream of mushroom, uh, mixed in some water, and just put it in the cup and drank it. Um, I don't know if that classifies as eating because technically soup you're eating soup so yeah like so i guess i broke my fast on day two but today i really broke my fast i was getting in my head i was like oh man you know i did this to myself you know god's not gonna be disappointed in me because i'm the one who chose to do this fast and you know i'm still gonna cut out all the other things like i get to choose what i'm gonna fast from whatever whatever so i talked myself into eating and uh, I don't feel guilty about it. I don't know if I should, but I don't. Uh, I'm going to keep doing the other things that I was doing during this seven days, these 14 days. Um, keep praying. Keep worshiping. I think I'm just going to fast and only eat at dinner time. So no breakfast and no lunch and no snacks and just only eat at dinner time. Because I'm headaches. Mm -mm. And then... Um, Yeah, I'm going to cut out, keep cutting out the secular anything and all that extra stuff. So, yeah, I came here to let y'all know that. There's no need for me to lie about it and pretend like I did whatever. I did not. And I don't know if I should be shamed, but I'm not. So, um, I've been listening to some sermons and they've really been speaking to me. So, I'm going to start making the changes that I feel is necessary. I already started organizing my organizing my house my sauna room is like the junkiest room right now so i want to take time probably this weekend to clean it um i'm going to make it a habit to keep dishes out of the sink granted it's never a lot of dishes probably like a bowl from gabby's grits in the morning a bowl of cereal and a few spoons it's never anything else. it's never piled up so so i'm going to try to make it a habit to just go ahead and just clean the dishes and just like keep dishes out of the sink you know um i've already started making up my bed every day that's been like a two-week thing now so there's little things you know i'm trying to get together make it make it turn into a habit you know um yeah don't i'm sorry for anybody who was uh rooting for me i'm sorry i didn't make it don't let me stop you from continuing your journey how you see fit but once again it's your journey so if you slip up give yourself grace you know 14 days is a long time granted i only made it to three days but still i'm proud of myself for even knowing that that much uh, i'm still going to continue to pray still going to continue to worship still going to continue to read my bible still going to listen to my sermons still going to um you know try my best for the next what, four days left, I guess? So, yeah. Them hunger headaches ain't no joke, though. There's not enough water in the world to make them headaches stop. It's already bad enough I have a history of migraines. Mm -mm. So, yeah.